Hello, Internet, and welcome back to the Ronverse. Aaron here with Pokemon Azure Horizons. Now, before anything else, quick pause of the game so that we can talk a little bit about it. This is actually an old hack. I think a lot of you OG ROM hack players already know about this game. It came out 2009 or 2010, according to the game info at the bottom over there interestingly enough but uh yeah a pretty old hack and this is never actually finished by the original creator of the hack i'm guessing his name was frostbite and the poke community post it makes that evident uh this only apparently went up until like the first four gyms or something that's what they said but very recently actually uh, mr hacks repairman a guy who randomly goes on Poke Community and fixes old hacks by unlocking all the content inside and fixing some scriptings and all that. He came and sort of like rescued this hack. It now has content up until the Elite Four and the Champion. So technically, this is a full game, uh, main story-wise. So I'm excited to play it. I haven't actually seen any of those OG Let's Players. I'm thinking guys like... Wait, did Munching Orange actually do a playthrough of this back in the day? I don't Anywho, I don't know the... Can't memorize the names, but I'm sure plenty of those, like, OG, like, 2010, 2011, uh, Pokemon ROM hack Let's Players on YouTube. I didn't watch any of those, um, yeah, I didn't watch any of those playthroughs. Uh, where I'm, we're going in this com completely blind once again. And also, hopefully you guys can give a little bit of an upvote, or like, a, a thumbs up for the... Pretty interesting new layout and thumbnails that I made for this series. I have a very interesting shape for my face cam here. I tried experimenting with something other than the usual square or slash rectangle shapes that you're used to. And also, you know, it's kind of overused now that I already have two playthroughs that, already ha that have the default rectangle shape. Kind of want to play with it a little bit, so... Hopefully you can see my face fine with this shape. So yeah. Anyhow, that's going to be it for my rambling in the intro like I always do. I'm actually going to put on my headset for a little bit. Gone are the days of the wireless Bluetooth headphones that I promised I'd be using because, well, apparently with DaVinci Resolve, they do some weird shit with the audio outputs. And it's a little bit of a hassle to have to redo everything over and over again. If I have to um, connect it by Bluetooth once more, my my audio or like my yeah these things. I don't know if you can see the, these like my wireless wireless earphones. They're sort of a bane. I already ordered some wired earphones actually and a splitter. I want to see if I can try splitting this and a wired version of this together so we could get. Seamless audio transitions like both of them playing at the same time, but I'll just switch to The earphones when I'm recording and then I'll switch to these when I'm editing or doing literally everything else. So yeah Anywho, I've rambled for three minutes. You're here for the gameplay. I'll put maybe a timestamp or something Let's just fucking start the game right now So apparently from the title screen alone uh, this game is apparently about Suicoon, so maybe we'll see her around a lot. Alright, this is basically just the same- Ah yeah, it's a hack of Pokemon Fire Red, so... Basically, once again, the same Fire Red text, I think. We'll start over here on the title screen. And it's Professor Oak, but as you can see, the background is blue, so that's how you know that this is the hack. The hack is successfully patched, unless, you know, you can just base it off the title screen as well. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. I am Alder. So I guess this guy predicted the name of the Unova Champion. Thank you, Frostbite. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. This world, once again a Nidoran, is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people are uh, for some people Pokemon are pets, others use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession, as you always do. But first, tell me a bit about yourself, ask me for my gender, I'm a boy, so we still have the regular 
Red icon. I think the overworld sprite's gonna be different. Yes, it is. Look at that. Looks pretty cool. Kind of reminiscent to Ruby Sapphire, but pretty cool. Alright, I will name myself the usual name for all my playthroughs. That is gonna be Bodoy. Yes. And this guy's my neighbor, apparently. Been your rival since you both were babies, of course. Holy shit, well, look at these awful, awful default names. Tyson, Cody, Dan, and Eric. No, 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 no. We're gonna name you something different. Um... Should I just go... Ah, should I just go, like, Voltsy style and name it my real name? No, no, no. We'll name it my real name, but backwards. So you are going to be... Nora. Ah. Uh, Nora. Ah. Uh, Nora. I don't even know. It's Aaron backwards. Who cares? It's our rival. That's right. I remember now his name is Nora. Hopefully I don't regret that name in the future. Bodoy! Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let us go and shrink you down with my laser vision. Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. Beautiful sprite work over here. Okay, before anything else. Tech speed, fast. Battle scene, keep that on. Battle style, shift, it's fine. Sound, let's keep that at mono, because uh, as you see, as you see me, I'm only using one ear, so I can hear myself talk in the other. So I want to hear all the audio in just one ear. I will use a blue frame, because this is Pokemon Azure Horizons after all. I have the bag already. Wait, I think I, already, I always do have the bag, right? To start things off. All right. Let's get that potion. Nothing over here. No running shoes yet. So I guess this is how they started hacks back in 2009. Back when they weren't too well optimized with quality of life improvements and stuff. So yeah, gotta understand that for old hacks. Who the fuck are you? It's my bro, Bodoy. Today is the day you get your Pokemon. Go to Professor Alder's lab, alright? I'll do just that. Let's go. Oh my god, that actually scared me a bit. Bodoy, come on, you're gonna be late. Okay, that's Nora, and that does not look like blue. Sweet. And it's bro speaking. Nora, don't barge in like that again. You scared us, dude. That literally scared me. Holy shit, yeah. The fucking music just jumped in out of nowhere. Oops, sorry about that. Ah, uh, whatever. Darn kids. Anyways, Bodoy, today's the big day. I'll meet you at Professor Alder's lab, okay? Don't be late. Yeah, 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 I was just about to do that, don't worry. Greenwood Town. What a way to start off Pokemon Azure Horizons by being in Greenwood Town. I don't know how that works. Where the seeds of new beginnings are planted. These guys coming up with some really cool flavor text for these Pokemon games. I'm a fan, I'm a fan. My son has always been impatient. Knowing him, though, I think he'll do just fine out here, or out there. Bodoy, please make sure he doesn't get into any trouble. I'm rooting for you, too. Thank you, adoptive mother of mine, because apparently I'm an orphan. My big bro thinks he's all tough. When I become a Pokemon trainer, I'll show him. It's really weird how you have to have an age limit to be a Pokemon trainer. Like, why can't you just be a... Pokemon trainer, but only be around in villages, you know? Just have village battles. You should be safe. Hey! I heard that po uh, Professor Alder has some awesome rare Pokemon at his lab. Okay. What are the starters going to be? Uh, cannot wait to check them out. There are so many Pokemon in this world of ours. I get excited just by thinking about it. Me too, buddy. Me too. Whoa, dude! The fucking lab... The layout of this lab already reminds me of Professor Oak's face. Holy shit, that's weird. Why does it remind me of Professor Oak's face? I think it's the eyebrows. The window things at the top for eyebrows. Holy shit. Wait. Oh, okay, so that's how we activate something. That's Alder? You're a lot younger than you look like in the intro screen, buddy. You shouldn't be going outside like that without a Pokemon by your side. Well, regardless, I've been looking for you. Today is the day you begin your journey. Come to my lab, if you will, with pleasure. Whoa, okay. Yo, Alder, calm down. No need to get your panties in a bunch. This guy sounds 
This guy looked impatient. Look at that jumping. Alder, where have you been? I've been trying to find you for a while now. I've been trying to find your friend Bodoy here. Heh, sorry about that. Sorry, my fault. I was trying to go in the wild grass of that Pokemon like a bad boy. Hmm. <clears throat> in these Pokeballs are Pokemon that I've assembled for you to- Assembled? Did he fucking make these things? From scratch, are we gonna get Robo Pokemon? That would be fucking sweet. Somebody make a ROM hack of that right away and I'll get to playing it ASAP. They'll be your partners throughout your journey. Bodoy, you may choose a first. Sweet. Wait a minute, no fair, I was here first. Alright, settle down, Nora. Settle down, Nora, you'll get your Pokemon. Okay, Gen 3. Trico. Mudkip. And Torchic. Alrighty, we are gonna go with Mudkip because I always go for Mudkip and I don't ever want to try Trico or Torchic even though they would be good additions for this. You know, or like even though if they would be the better options for this ROM hack whatsoever because Mudkip is my boy and I live for 2009 memes and also Pokemon Azure Horizons. It's a blue game. I'm picking the blue Pokemon. Fuck all of you. This video is not monetized so fuck all of you. Let's play with Mudkip. Good choice. You're goddamn right. You are goddamn right. No one judge me on this one. Mudkip. Uh, female Mudkip. Interesting. I hope we got a good nature too. I will call you. Well, I used uh, Mudkip in Pokemon Saffron and I called it Marshall. But you are female so I'll call you... Mar... Marshall. See what I did there? You know how I like it. And Nora, little bitch boy, is gonna pick the Trico, of course. Also, I think this is the first ROM hack in a while that I've experienced that doesn't actually have capitalizations. Like, de auto decapitalization in the Pokemon. So yeah, Mudkip, still in bold letters, which is interesting. But it's pretty cool, it's pretty cool, nonetheless. Okay, uh, was that careful nature? Attack is pretty strong, 12, I guess, that's okay. Tackle and Growl, so we don't have any stab moves yet, like we usually do in other Pokemon ROM hacks, but it's okay. So I'm guessing this is how it works in the Fire Red Leaf Green. Like, you try to go down here, and uh, Nora will try to battle us. Yo, doesn't? The fuck? My Pokemon looks a lot tougher than yours. Alright, so no rival battle yet, I guess. If a wild Pokemon appears, your Pokemon can battle it. With that at your side, you should be able to keep going. That's my hunch too. Alright, let's go outside. Maybe we'll battle outside. Who knows? Yeah. Alright, so do we, can we just like go out? We can just go- Oh, holy shit. Route 801. Where the fuck are we? I just realized I don't actually know what region name this is. Can't remember. It's in the- All the information you, you need though is in the- um, Link in the description to the Poke Community page. Also, I think I might just link the download, like the post to the download of this ROM hack from because I'm using Hacks Repairman's version, so I'll just link his. I think that was his WordPress. That's gonna be in the description as well. If I hopefully I remember to do that. Wait, can we literally just progress to the next town over, or can we get running shoes from Mom first? I want to see if we can get running shoes from Mom. Not mom. Bro. I mean, sorry. Oh. I see that you have a Pokemon out here. Have some rest. Gosh darn it. Alright. We are orphans. That or we were old enough to move out into Greenwood Town by ourselves. But apparently, we weren't old enough to have our own Pokemon. I don't know how that works. Alright, no more dilly-dallying. Let's get to Route um, 801. Gordian Town. Next. Looks like we're gonna have to walk. Molasses speed. Oh dear, so this is where the battle occurs. I see. I see how it is. Hey, wait up, Bodoy. Now that we have Pokemon, shouldn't there be one thing left to do? I've been itching to battle ever since we've first known each other. I've always wanted to say this. Bodoy, I challenge you to a Pokemon battle. I don't know us to what accent we're gonna use for. Holy shit, you have an amazing icon, by the way. Sprite. Sorry. I don't know what accent we're gonna use for Nora, so that's gonna change around a lot. Just know that I don't really care that much. Ha! A first battle. 
Since you're new at this, let me give you a heads up. Aren't you new as well, Nora? Come on, don't be that guy. Don't be that guy. In the trainer battle, you want to see who's better. So the trainer that makes other trainers Pokemon faint by lowering their HP to zero wins. Got it? Good. Let's get going. I have a feeling Trico at speeds. Am I gonna lose money straight away? Yeah, you yeah, outspeed me. I do have a potion though, so that's pretty good. Oh, I do more damage at least. Ouch! Dealing damage to the foe is the key to battling. I like that the hackmaker also took the time to change the uh, text for this. Like, give it some custom text. I think it, that might be easy, but I like that they did that feature. I like they added that. <laughs> Leers though. I mean, I could just counter that with a growl, but then again... What's the point? You're gonna outspeed me anyway. Oh, that's gonna do more. Not really much more. What the hell? And that's with one leer. Am I am I seriously a tank? I am a hell of a tank, dude. Once again. Further solidifying my stance that Mudkip is the best starter of Hoenn. Yes, that is fact. And I learned mud mud slap. That is a fact. Mud slap level six. Let's fucking go. What just happened? Did I lose? Yeah, yeah. You just did. Ugh. Great, I just lost. The more battles you're in, the stronger you'll become. Remember that. I will. I will, Nora. You too. That was an awesome battle. Oh uh, yeah, after you left, Alder asked me to uh, tell you if you can do a favor for him. He wants you to pick something up at Gordian's Pokemon. Dude, this is basically just a uh, reenactment of Pokemon Fire Red, but like with a different layout, different set of characters and shit. It's cool though. It's cool. I wonder what it is, but anyway, my Pokemon needs some rest, so I'm out. Peace. Yo, dude, the rest the rest house is like back at our place. He's gonna fucking die out there, I guarantee it. We're gonna go actually rest for real. And, uh, let's go to the next route, armed with only a potion and a dream. No Pokeballs yet, so the best we can do... Is just walk through this grass and see what Pokemon we can find. Ralts, yo, that's pretty dope. Pretty dope. Uh, let's tackle you, I guess. Yeah, I get some experience. Get to maybe level seven. So close, though. All right. What more do we find here? Very interesting layout too. Let me just say that. Oh, we find C dots too. Okay, so if we decide uh, if we decide to catch a C dot, we have an instant grass type in our team. Uh oh, bide. I don't like you. Growl. Wait, uh, why isn't bide like a plus one priority? Why did I tackle first and then it bided? That's weird. Wait, and then it bowed? Is that the past tense for bide? I don't even know. Oh shit! It still hit me. That's fine. It's weird how Bide works. I still don't know how it fully works in game, but yeah, kind of useful, I guess. Wait, this just loops back, doesn't it? Zigzagoon. All right, so far, completely new Pokemon. Completely new Pokemon still. Uh, let's get another. Oh shit, we miss a tackle. Let's run away real quick. I need to heal. Yeah. Um, is the next town right here? Trainer tips. Catch Pokemon and expand your collection. The more you have, the easier it is to battle. True. That's why I overstock myself. Gordian Town immediately. Okay. Maybe let's. Uh, no, no, actually, let's not explore a little bit. We'll do that next episode. I just need to heal, actually. Oh, hey, wait up. Well, you're in your face. You must be a rookie trainer, right? Since you've never been here, let me show you around the town. Follow me. Okay, quick tutorial. Let's just get past this, I guess. Over here is a Pokemon Center. Pokemon centers heal your Pokemon free of charge. You can easily recognize them by their red roofs. I thought it's more scarlet orange, in my opinion. Over here is a Pokemart. At Marts, you can buy items vital for on-the-road trainers like you. Since you're still starting out, you won't have much of a selection. Don't let that worry you, though. As you progress and get more gym badges, you'll be able to buy more items at all Marts. Trying to give him that like infomercial enthusiastic voice because I feel like he's that kind of guy there's already a gym oh shit finally here's a Pokemon gym they're located in just about every town and city throughout the region 
at gyms, trainers will be able to challenge gym leaders for badges. With enough badges, a trainer can challenge the Pokemon League. And League is spelled wrong, but we'll let that pass. This gym doesn't seem to be open at the moment, though. You know, I appreciate that you took the time to take my little tour that is unskippable. As a gift, thank you for the town map, boy. I appreciate that. With the town map, you'll be able to pinpoint your exact location. Also, cool tip, when you hover over a certain location like a forest or a cave, for instance, press the A button to look up info on that place. Okay. I would have given you a longer tour of the town, but I'm short on time. Good luck on your journey. I don't even know where you have to go after this. So, thank you for that. Uh, before we end this episode, let's go check out the town map. Let's see how big this fucking map is. I am already blown away, and I love that this is all going to be explorable. I hope to God that this is not going to be one of those really, really hard hacks. Oh my God, quote me on that if I fucking have a mental breakdown later on this and later on in this uh, playthrough. Azure City, dude, fucking Pokemon Cyan stole some of these uh, names. I remember Azure City being a name in Pokemon Cyan too, a city. I don't know why I remember that, but it's cool. So yeah, Zephyr. Okay, so I'm guessing Zephyr is the name of this region, which is pretty cool. Dude, look at that. Look at all this place. Let's get ready for some lo uh, good content, boys. Alright. So, next episode, we are going to explore this town and maybe just do whatever the hell we need to do from then. So leave a like if you enjoyed this first episode. Maybe we can get some two, three likes for a new series Let's Play. And for a complete game this time, no more of those, like, stuck in beta games for a little while at least. So, yeah. I already said it, right? Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next episode. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.